find the place, you must trek through snaking forestry plantation paths. A hidden bay unsignposted, unknown to all but a select few. The man who lived here was a man of contradictions, blown about by ambition and whim, from one end of his life to the other, a reed shaken by the wind of his own chaotic impulses. I've come here to seek him in the place he loved, a secluded cove in the West Highlands. He named it Camisferna. You will find it on the map as Sandaig a mainland bay in the lee of the Isle of Skye. Rain falls here often, relentless, pitiless rain. Since he died before I was born, I could never have known him, but it was after him that I was named. He took great care over naming. Names have significance. Ring of bright water. A reed shaken by the wind. The rocks remain. Ravens seek thy brother. These evocative titles sold millions, but then Hollywood desecrated his memory with a casually vapid biopic. If only Gavin had said yes to Michael Powell, how differently his memory might have been served. His beloved Otter Edal is buried here, a few paces from his own final resting place. The pilgrims who make it here leave offerings for man and Otter. More for Otter than man, it's true. His weather-worn cottage with its creeping cluster of outbuildings burnt down in 1968. Occasionally charred fragments of the past wash up on the shore amidst the usual seaborne detritus, plastic bottles, seaweed and string. Lunatic driver, a financial incompetent, self-closeted homosexual, eternal dreamer. Water glints brightest where agitated by hidden currents. The sea meets the curve of the river, and a ghost walks the shore lost in the reverie of an untamed life.